Okay. So apparently stepping on the switch solved it. Good job in solving it so quickly. You didn't even need my help. Which is great, cause I love doing absolutely nothing. Yeah, there's nothing in there. Dang it. I'm trying to press Z around everything. I think that's Metaton over there. Hey! It's the human! You're gonna love this puzzle! It was made by the great Dr. Alphys! You see these tiles? Once I throw this switch, they will begin to change color! Each color has a different function! Red tiles are impossible! You cannot walk on them! Yellow tiles are electric! They will electrocute you! Green tiles are alarm tiles! If you step on them... You will have to fight a monster! Uh, I'm losing my voice. Orange tiles are orange scented! They will make you smell delicious! Blue tiles are water tiles! Swim through them if you like, but... If you smell like oranges, the piranhas will bite you! Also, if a blue tile is next to a yellow tile, the water will also zap you! Purple tiles are slippery! You will slide to the next tile! However, the slippery soap smells like lemons, which piranhas do not like! Purple and blue are okay! Finally, pink tiles! They don't do anything! So, blue, pink, and purple. Step on them if you all you like. How was that? Understand? Uh, no. Okay, I guess I'll repeat myself. Red tiles are impassable. Yellow tiles are electric and dangerous. Blue tiles make you fight a monster. Green tiles are water tiles. Orange tiles are orange scented. If you step on orange, don't step on green. Brown tiles are... Wait! There are no brown tiles! Purple tiles smell like lemons. Why don't the yellow ones smell lemony? Um, wait! Did I mix up green and blue? The blue ones are water ones. Pink tiles? I don't remember. Wait! Those ones don't do anything! Okay! Do you understand better now? Even less. Let's see what happens. <laughs> okay, you know what? How about you just do this puzzle on your own? I'll leave the instructions. Just read them. Then when you understand it, you can throw the switch. And do it at your own pace. Good luck! Heh <laughs> Actually, that spaghetti from earlier, it wasn't too bad for my brother. Since he started cooking lessons, since he started cooking lessons, he's been improving a lot. I bet if he keeps it up, next year he'll even be able to make something edible. It's an eligible chicken scratch. It's an eligible chicken scratch. The machine isn't working. Mm -mm. Here we have lesser dogs, land of snow statues, S snow lesser dogs. There are snow lesser dogs. Aware of dog, please pet dog. On the floor inside is a box of pomera- Pomeraisins. A dog just rushed in here, filled with inspiration. It kept trying to build a snow dog that expressed its own emotions. But, as it built, it kept getting more excited about the sculpture. Its neck got longer and longer, and it added more and more snow. Until, it was rather sad to watch, but I couldn't turn away. Knowing that dog will never give up trying to make the perfect snow dog, it fills you with determination!
What's down here? It's a snow papyrus. It's a lump of snow with the word sans written on it in red marker. Yep, that's sans. Yeah, let's solve this puzzle. Yeah. As we go through, we have a hat. What's up? Oh dear. Gift shot confronts you. I'm gonna undecorate it after I check it. Some teens decorated it as a prank. Is this funny to you? Gift Trot laments its lack of hands. Let's undecorate. You have a stocking filled with chicken nuggets. Okay. That's a little better. I keep using the same voice, I think. Gift Trot is slightly less irritated. You remove the shirt that says, I'm with stupid, and points inward. That's a little better. Oh, dang it. Gift shot is slightly less irritated. Let's undecorate. Remove a childhood photograph of Snowdrake and his parent. A weight has been lifted. A weight has been lifted. I should use that voice. Gift shot problems have been taken away. I won. We got 20 gold. Let's see what's in the cave. Oh, hey, there's a house in the distance. Apparently, if I stand here around, walking around for three minutes, I will somehow battle. I will do this. I will battle whatever that guy's name was. It's cool you even built the whole game in uh, Minecraft. What was his name again? Glyph or something? So yeah, just gonna hang out here a little bit. Pacing. Slowly pacing. Mm-hmm. Good times, good times. So do I fight yet, or not yet? It's a door. So yes, as a reminder, and I will read this off from the chat, I am streaming tonight as part of the annual week of Halloween Donation Drive. And this is here is to help official Keiko and Gilly with his move to York on the 1st. There will be raffle drawings on the 1st for donation for donators, so spread the word. Glide swooped in. Attack high, defense high. Refuses to give more details about its statistics. 
How pretentious. How great I am. Glad is thinking of new slang for the word cool. Like, freakadacious. It's like a monster candy. Wow, check out my pecs. Glad he's giving himself a high five, somehow. You clap really sloppily. Glide sucks up your praise like a vacuum cleaner. Okay, I rule, I admit it. I applied twice, I think. Clap like a gorilla. Glide is becoming addicted to your praise. What else do you have to say? And get some monster candy. You ate the monster candy. Very on licorice like. Yeah. You do nothing. Glad looks disappointed you aren't paying attention. Eh, you forgot to clap. Glad sees its reflection and gets jealous. You do nothing. Glad looks desperate for attention. Hello, I'm right here. Glad's doing tons of flips to get your attention. You do nothing. Glad leaves to look elsewhere for praise. You won. Yeah. I beat Glide. It's a door. I want to get through that door. But apparently I have to make sure that I do never... I'm. In order to get past that door, apparently I have to never get hit in the ending credits. Say, are you following me? You should have liked exercise. Yeah. Hey. It's a snow puff. What a tiny doghouse. Woof. <laughs> and this is a snow puff. This, however, is a snow puff. Surprisingly, it's a snow puff. Snow puff. It, is it really a snow puff? Behold, a snow puff. Hey, there's 30G inside this. What is this? It's a snow puff. And this is a snow puff. Okay, so apparently it repeats. Yep. It's a Pomeranian. That has battle armor. The dog song. Yeah. Let's check. Great dog. Attack. 15. Defense. 8. It's so excited that it th thinks fighting is just play. That's BS. Greater Dog is waiting for your command. I have to get some nice cream. Love yourself, I love you. Love yourself, I love you. There we go.
You recovered 15 HP. Good dog is watching you intently. You call the greater dog. It bounds towards you, flicking slobber onto your face, into your face. Yeah, that was a bad idea. Greater dog is seeking affection. Greater dog curls up on your lap as it pet is pet by you. It gets so comfortable it falls asleep. Z z z z. Then it wakes up. It's so excited! Credit Dog is patting the ground with its front paws. Play. Make a snowball and throw it for the dog to fetch. It splats on the ground. Credit Dog picks up all the snow in the area and brings it to you. <laughs> now Dog is very tired. It rests its head on you. Greater Dog wants some TLC. As you pet the dog, it sinks its entire weight into you. Your movements are slow. Your movement's slow. But you still haven't pet enough. Dang it. Pet capacity is 40%. You pet decisively. Pet capacity reaches 100%. The dog flops over with its legs hanging in the air. Look at that little tail wag. Greater dog is contented. Spare with a happy dog. Lick. <clears throat> Somehow it walks. <laughs> 